<laughs> hey, what's up, man? It's your boy, Too Much Drama TV. We're in the building. Ah, football season is upon us. The leaves are falling. I'm excited. I'm excited about the Philadelphia Eagles this year, man. Now, if you guys don't know me, I've done a lot of videos talking about the Philadelphia Eagles, how they ain't going to do shit. Well, I'm sticking to my guns. Now, <laughs> LaShawn McCoy is no longer there. Jeremy Macklin is no longer there. They have Riley Cooper as their number one receiver. They got Matthews, who's a pretty solid receiver. I give him props, man. He's all right out of Vanderbilt University. The quarterback of the Philadelphia Eagles is a guy named Sam Bradford, who has two torn ACL injuries that he's recovering from. And apparently that's going to be their starting quarterback, okay? You got Tim Tebow, second, third string, whatever. This, <laughs> what the hell are you guys going to do at running back? Look, I know what you're going to say. Well, what do you mean? We, we, got, we got DeMarco Murray from Dallas. He ran for 1,500, 1,600 yards last year. Oh, oh, wait a minute. The same DeMarco Murray that was injury, injury prone throughout his whole career up until last year? Oh, wait, wait. Hey, some guy, I don't know, some guy wrote some comment about Kiko Alonso. Bro, let me tell you something about Kiko Alonso. Yeah, he's pretty good. He's a tackling machine. He just came off an ACL injury. Who's to say this guy ain't going to get injured? Are you kidding me? Really? Ryan Matthews from the Chargers. <laughs> Look, I like Ryan Matthews when he was in college because he didn't get hurt a whole bunch. San Diego Lions, why do you think they were playing with Danny Woodhead out there in San Diego? Because Ryan Matthews couldn't stay healthy. Now, I know they're going to be splitting carries with Sproles, with Matthews, with DeMarco Murray, with Josh Huff and stuff like that. I get all that. But who, come on. If you cough on Matthews, fucking guy get hurt. Sam Bradford, two ACL injuries. You really think this guy's going to stay healthy? Let's say this guy gets hurt. Here comes Mark Sanchez. The ultimate accident waiting to happen. You really think that the Philadelphia Eagles are going to win the division? Right now, I'm picking the Dallas Cowboys to win the division. Not because I'm a Dallas Cowboys fan. Because I think the Eagles are going to self-destruct. You don't have a defense. You mean to tell me that Kiko Alonso is going to be the anchor to that fucking defense? I don't think so, man. All right? Now, they're going to be a fast, run-and-gun offense. I get all that. But that shit is not going to translate into wins when it really matters. Last year, did the Philadelphia Eagles go to the playoffs? No. All right? So all I'm saying is pump your motherfucking brakes when you start throwing out names like DeMarco Murray, who was the leader in Russia last year, Ryan Matthews, and you start throwing out Kiko Alonso. Because I'm looking at Kansas City. Y'all can use Jeremy Macklin. Y'all ain't got no good receivers. Riley Cooper? Riley Cooper's claim to fame is he's a fucking great block and wide receiver. He can't run routes. He's slow. He's six foot three. He doesn't use his height. Come on, man. Come on. It seems like Chip Kelly's getting all of his guys from Oregon. There's one thing I am going to say, though. Y'all do look good in the preseason. This isn't the motherfucking preseason that we're about to approach, all right? This is the regular season. The Philadelphia Eagles will win eight games. They will win eight games. They will self-destruct. They're going to be injury-prone. The Dallas Cowboys will win that division. Mark my word, all right? And for all these other fools, eat that pussy 4 for 5 and all these other little Eagles fans fly high and all that, you guys are going to eat my words once again. This is going to be the fourth motherfucking year in a row where I told you guys over and over again that the Philadelphia Eagles ain't going to do shit. It's your boy Too Much Drama TV, man. Make sure you guys hit that dislike button, man. And holler at your boy. Yay!